Hello, welcome. Um, today I'm gonna be doing something, maybe. <laughs> so today is my 23rd birthday, and today I'm also gonna make an attempt to run 23 miles. 23 miles for my 23rd birthday. If you watched my previous video, you might know that I uh, I'm training for a triathlon. So with that being said, I started running again. I'm doing more mileage than I ever have been. This is really the first run in a long time that's gonna be testing my limits. 23 miles is by far the longest distance I've ever attempted to run. Uh, I've done 14 miles before. I think that was my longest run, which was about two months ago, which I guess now that I'm thinking about it, I have to do like double that. I mean, I don't have to. That's the thing. Like, nobody's forcing me to do this. I'm in a much different place than I was a year ago, and I think this will be kind of a, a good test mentally and physically to see where I'm at. Honestly, I'm just talking a lot at this point because I'm kind of, like, procrastinating. Because <laughs> I'm a little bit nervous because I, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. But that's the whole point is to test myself, right? The only thing I'm worried about besides the snow and the cold weather is my right hamstring. I have been battling with my right hamstring a little bit. I took a little rest this past week in order to, you know, try to make things a little better. The plan is just to start really slow, and then if I'm feeling solid, I'll end up going faster and faster as I go. I think that's the best way to approach this because I've never run this sort of distance and I don't want to go too fast and like hurt myself right out of the start, so. All right, time to stop talking. Let's just, let's go for it, dude. Yeah, <laughs> the road doesn't look good. Some of it's snow, but then there's like a little like icy parts, so I'm a little nervous about that. Yeah, I'm not sure how that, okay. I just gotta stop that. I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna do it. It's not even a big deal. Nope, 23. It's not even a big number, right? Not even a marathon? <laughs> All right, mile one, done. Feeling decent. Uh, my hamstring is a little iffy, I don't know. It's feeling better the more I warm up though, so. <sighs> mile two, um, we're like 16 minutes in, so I'm holding like a eight minute pace so far. Honestly, I should probably slow down. <laughs> Maybe I can hold eight minutes for 23 miles, but I don't know about that. So time will tell. Mile three. Roads are actually better than expected, so. Probably just jinx it though. <laughs> Uh, four. Uh. All right, I'm nearing the end of this lap and uh, there's definitely more snow on like the last two miles of this road. So it's doable though, so. One lap is done. It was, it was like 10.2 kilometers. So I think it's, it's closer to like six and a half miles a lap. I'm taking like a two minute break mm. Mm. liquid sugar baby delicious all right two minute break is over so far i'm on pace to do like three hours 20 minutes don't know if i'm gonna stay on pace for that but the goal is under three hours 30 minutes so all right guys i'm about halfway done 11 and a half miles down. Definitely feeling it. <laughs> I think I got cocky for the first like five or six miles. Like the next, the next half is definitely gonna be where it's gonna start to hurt. So. <sighs> All right, so I'm at like mile 18. Uh, I have five left. I thought this was gonna be closer to like four laps but I think it would have ended up being like three and a half, which means I would have had to basically stop at 23 and then walk the rest of the three miles around. Either that or do a marathon. So I just turned around, now I'm running in the opposite direction. So hopefully that'll put me back at the start right around 
23 miles. <laughs> I was gonna record every mile, but it's getting harder and harder to do that, so. <laughs> So yeah, less than five miles to go. I'm really starting to hurt, but just gotta power through. Hey, right, quarter mile to go. This hurts, bro. It's really hurt. There's one more hill. Okay. So I can, I can like hear my heartbeat. <laughs> well, I hope I can get up. Oh, bro. Sometimes you'll, you hear people talking about like, a runner's I feel like it's more just dissociation when you're going at it for that long and you're in pain you you have to kind of separate your mind from your body it's probably also like dehydration and whatnot <laughs> honestly I thought I'd feel more accomplished but I think it's just right now it's I can't feel much of anything I should probably stretch before my legs like permanently Tighten up.